Well, so I'm from the University of Cincinnati, which is uh, a research uh, university in the United States that's in southwest Ohio. It has about 35,000 undergraduate students. Well, I do work on embodied cognition, so looking at relationships between kind of the, the body and the mind, how they work together. Sure, uh, I'm working on the kind of relationship between linguistics and embodiment and how maybe uh, things about our bodies and our movements might be reflected in longer term linguistic interactions. I'm working with Dr. Uh, Nicola Gilio and Dr. Lydia Maihodak. Well, probably the highlight has been uh, when I presented our kind of preliminary work and, and my uh, kind of the research that I'd done leading up to that work um, last week. So at the, with the doctoral school. Um, actually, I've done a visiting scholar um, at the Hapital uh, Pellegrin, uh, uh, working on a project related to Alzheimer's for the University of Bordeaux. Well, we use this visit, uh, which is quite short, about a month, to just brainstorm and kind of figure out our approach and uh, kind of do some proof of concept analyses. And then we'll kind of continue interacting long distance um, through email and, and, you know, video meetings and things like that to try and get some uh, whole project together that we can maybe share as an article or something. Well, I really like being able to go to uh, different universities and kind of interact with people in different disciplines. And especially in different countries, you get to see how things are done differently but still work out. And so I think that's a, a really good for you to, as a researcher, as a scientist, and even as a person to, to see that there are many different ways of, of doing research and, and interacting. and doing things. Yeah, and I just uh, would really like to thank the University of Bordeaux Montaigne for the invitation and the opportunity to, uh, to visit and to work with everyone here. It's been a great 